So we just uh, came by to find out how you were doing. I thought we were here to find Billy. Remember? You said you were scared because Frank used to date her. You also said that one of us should do all the talking. It was you. Go ahead, Earl. Whoa, 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 whoa. You, you want to date Billy? Yes, and, and I just want you to know that karma's on my side, so if you attack me, something bad will happen to you. Uh, you know what? Don't worry about it. I'm over her anyway. Really? You're really over her? Yeah. Plus, she's living a good life now, like you. Hey, it'd be like if Mother Teresa started dating that ball guy in the diapers. What's his name? Gumby. Thanks, Frank. That means a lot. So, can you help me find Billy? Yeah, yeah, I, I could do that, but, but you gotta help me first. I need a job so I could get out of here every day. Maybe we could get him a job as a bikini inspector. I've seen the uniforms on sale at the mall. Or he could be a beaver hunter, but you might need a license for that. I knew I needed Frank's help, so I went to see if Darnell would be willing to hire him. He won't even be around to bother you, because he'll be helping me find Billy. Are you sure the boys are okay? I told them they were bunk beds and they believed me. I'm starting to realize there's no point in saving up for college. I'll hire Frank if it's okay with Joy. The man did point a gun at her belly when she was delivering a baby. What? My baby? I don't give a crap. Oh, come on. Who calls a bar after 7 o'clock? We got kids sleeping. The next day, Frank was officially employed and pretty excited to get a little taste of freedom. Frank thought the best place to look for Billy was her cousin Jocelyn's. You have a lot of nerve thinking you can walk in here